Hey guys, it's Michelle. Welcome or welcome back. I have an exciting video for you. I have two handbag unboxings. So it is an unboxing week for me. I already unboxed my FabFitFun box and now I have my handbag from my sponsor, Teddy Blake. This is not the first time. This is the fourth time they have sent me a handbag and I'm so excited and so thankful because actually they have become my favorite handbag company. Hands down, whenever anybody asks, let me show you the ones I have already. This was the first little girl I got. She is the Kim 9 inch in light gray stampato leather. By the way, they all have shoulder straps that you can attach to it, crossbody straps. This is my second one, the Ava 9 inch Croco Gold, and she's my absolute favorite. This is the head turner of the bunch because of her color. I love, 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 love a red bag. It's like wearing red lipstick. She looks amazing. And then I got, I said I don't like to buy black bags, but when I saw this one, I had to have her. Um, this is the Ava Lizard Gold 9 inch. Ooh, my nails look really good against her. Absolutely love carrying Teddy Blake because when I carry her, she looks expensive. And guess what? She is a beautiful price point. Most of the bags are under $500. Now with Mother's Day coming up, this is the perfect, perfect gift to give your mom because they are practical. Let us open this Teddy Blake. The box always looks like this. She always has a beautiful box that you can, you know, use for other stuff. Like I'm using mine for skincare and cosmetics. And actually, I also ordered a little piece here for a giveaway that we'll talk about later. But here she is, all in her grand packaging. Bubble wrap for any of you with anxiety. <laughs> I love bubble wrap. And here is the dust bag. So this time I ordered the nine inch Kate because Kate is a style I have not owned before. And here she is. Here's the front with the Teddy Blake logo wow she is stunning and of course i'm already looking at her like i've got to order two hot pink bandeau scarves for the handles or whatever color i decided to get her in neutral because neutral bags i think are really in right now they're great for spring and you can pop the handle with any color so this is the cream kate nine inch so these things right here, what I noticed about her, just studying her online, you can open up these little snaps here to open up the bag. Her shape and the functionality of the side straps, those little snaps, are similar to YSL Sac Du Jour. There are two pockets, two pockets that come right out. So the capacity it looks a little small, but once you open it up, there's quite a bit of room in there. I did order a, let me open this because this is a giveaway. So let me make a giveaway rule. If you are watching the video, I should have you type in Happy Mother's Day because Mother's Day is around the corner and if nobody is giving you presents and you're a mom, you can give them to yourself. So I wanted to give away a cute coin purse. This one is in pink croco. You can see she has a smaller croco detail on one side, but I wanted to give one of these away because I had ordered one with my red bag and she is absolutely stunning. Absolutely stunning. Very good quality for a small leather good coin purse, which of course you can put your coins in and there's a little clip here if you want to clip her on anything, but I love using mine. So I asked Teddy Blake to sponsor one so that we could give away to my lovely audience. So that fits in there nicely. The purse does not close completely the way you would close it is these little snaps here. So let's put her crossbody strap on too. She does come in different colors. I actually wanted her in black, but then I have this black one. She doesn't have feet, so the Avas have feet. That makes a nice touch, especially when you're washing your hands in the public bathroom and you want to put her down on the counter. So this 
bag has an accordion style and she doesn't have feet, so she's gonna stand right up here on this part of the bag. Let's put the crossbody strap. Oh, and she comes with the little key bell. Ava also comes with a key bell, but I didn't wanna put her on. It was like too much stuff for me, especially because she actually doesn't have a key. Oh, okay, just kidding. It's a faux lock, okay? <laughs> so it's just an accessory. So I noticed that some of the high-end brands do that anyway, like I just showed a YSL bag that has one of these and it's a YSL instead of a key. Like it's just for extra bells and whistles. If you wanted to put it on the bag, let's just put it on the bag so you can see what it would look like. There you go. You can do that if you wanted to like have extra tassels and whatever on your bag. So here's the crossbody strap. I do like the color of this because it looks like I mean, I hate saying it because I would never carry a real white crocodile, but it does look like animal hide and it has some variations. You know what I mean? Like variations in the color. She's small enough to not bother me as a crossbody because most of the time I just like handle bags. I can even make this longer. You see, there's still a hole here where I can make the crossbody strap longer. But I think for me, I could probably make it one inch longer but this length is just fine too. Okay, I've grabbed some stuff so I can do a wet fit. So here is my Kate Spade, oh no, it's my Tory Burch key fob. Yeah, you do have to unsnap the bag so it opens, otherwise it's impossible to get into. My card holder, my serum stick, and my sunglasses. I would say it's just as much capacity as the Ava. I guess if you wanted to, you can open the snap to give it a little more room. But it's a super cute bag. I really, really love it and I can't wait to use it tomorrow. Then I will give you the full report on how I enjoyed using the bag. Now the second opening I have, look at this big, big package here. This is from Naomi J. I'm going to link her down in the description. She upcycles handbags, mainly dust bags, and she is in Hong Kong. I saw her crafty talent when it came to patchwork of denim squares, and she reached out and asked me if I wanted to share a bag on my social media. So when I saw her patchwork, I thought that is the one that I want because I appreciate design and craftsmanship. Oh my gosh, how cute is this? I just knew when I saw her like piles of fabric, this sewn together and, and I'm assuming they were jeans or jackets, how she arranged the colors. It is so stinking cute. Ta-da. Okay, now not sure where this is from, if it's upcycled from a Chanel bag or what have you. And there's one here on the handle as well. Oh my God, girl, I love the way the denim is also intertwined into the chain. That looks like it took a little bit of work to do so. Okay, so let's check out the bag. There's two snaps, nope, three snaps across the top. And ooh, a nice, quilted lining inside, a zipper, a zippered baggie, and it looks like she can fit a lot of stuff. So let's just put my cosmetics pouch all the way in there. The coin purse, because honestly, I would carry this bag even if it did not have the Chanel. It's that cute, like it's super cute, super cute. Like, wow, I can't wait to use this. Thanks, Naomi. I'm gonna put her uh, link down in the description. Okay, so something I'm gonna explain to you guys. I've been to Hong Kong many times. They are all about brand names and labels. It's one place that tourists go to buy knockoffs. Knockoffs are all over the streets, like sweatshirts with the free logos. I think my, ma my aunt bought me my first pair of Reeboks, but I kind of knew like something was off because they didn't come in lavender in the US. Anything they could put a label on, they would, and I'm sure they have really good replica one-on-one -on -one mirrors now, but they all, at the time too, they're all about like putting the 
logo on anything. So it's, it's kind of a culture. Um, so I'm not mad at it. Like that's, that is why she probably found, if they're not upcycled, you can find things like this, like fairly easily and Chanel S it, if you know what I mean. I see I can also scrunch it like this. So it's, it's very much like the, um, the Chanel 22. The one I call the garbage bag, but I happen to love this patchwork denim by Naomi. It is absolutely beautiful, girlfriend. And oh my gosh, how cute with a summer dress. I'm not really a shoulder bag person, but I will rock this. I am gonna rock this. So thank you to Naomi. Be sure to check her out. And thank you to Teddy Blake. You can find my discount code for Teddy Blake down in the description. I'm gonna take both of these bags for a spin and then come back and give you the full report and let you know. Thank you guys. Don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button and I will see you soon. Bye.